Well, first and foremost, whenever you talk about entertainment experiences, the first requirement is entertaining. And this year alone, we're seeing major new launches coming up from the major media players that's going to continue to evolve the landscape. And we've, um, you know, we continue to see that um, content is what drives a lot of usage of OTT channels. It's 57% uh, of people subscribe to OTT services for exclusive content. And for um, millennials, it's even higher, above 70%. I think uh, immersive experiences that allow you to connect with others are going to break out. Um, we'll, you know, certainly the glass experiences have worked in enterprise. People like technology. And I think as an industry, we see right now a lot of tension of, oh, you can just put it down. But technology is going to become more and more part of our lives. And so how do we embed it into the, in a way that we can still allow that connection and it becomes a enhancer potentially of that and doesn't have to take away from it. The goal is to find the right balance and the ability to um, utilize the screen time that you have in a way that's helpful, um, especially social media is harder. So you see it in teenagers. Um, interestingly, um, for girls using social media is more harmful to their self-confidence versus boys who are typically more using gaming and connecting, it's um, less harmful.